You gotta give them credit. They got decent music for in here. I don't know what a shard is, but when I figure it out... We... All the fun, right? Alright. We I wonder if that very thing you can plant apricots, because that'd be cool. Alright. Nope, that was the wrong way. Definitely went the wrong way. <laughs> All right, let's do this for reals now. We let's get us a Vulpix and avoid fighting that guy. I'm gonna try really hard to avoid him. The only terrifying thing is the one I want to use to catch the Vulpix is uh... poor Scyther here. I'm glad flying isn't weak against flying. Or strong against flying. Yeah, words. Yay, level 23. We're getting closer. Hopefully the Eevees have an egg soon. Also, I don't know... Hmm. Time to look up some things. Could have swore that said level two for a split second, and I was like, "Oh, that feels like a ripoff." Da na 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 na. The only thing we gotta be careful with is eventually we're gonna run into a uh, Nidoran that has poisonous skin, and then we're gonna have some issues. Oh, there's Vulpix. Never mind. I don't need to keep looking up what I was looking up. <laughs> the answer is here in front of us. I was worried that she only comes out at night. <laughs> that was more my concern. Um... Or at least she won't take that long to catch up to uh, Scyther. So, that's a positive. Oh, you bitch! Damn it. Alright, shouldn't have switched. Forgot about the roar. Forgot about the roar.
damn it. <sighs> oh, we don't have any antidotes. All right. This is gonna suck. Actually, what we should probably do, now that I think about it, since we can now go to this piece of grass, what we should... piece of grass. Ah, oh, that was funny. Uh, what we should probably do is do it closer to the uh, the next town over so it's easier. Well, we better be down. We gotta be down the uh, twins there too. While we're at it, so. Just hoping she doesn't die before we get back. Oh, that's painful. Don't die on me. Yes, I would like my Pokemon not to be poisoned anymore. <laughs> we... Do this for reals. We'll go beat down the twins at uh Oh yeah, she gives quick claw. That might be something good to have on uh Scyther. Yay! Now we can strike harder, harder and faster. There you go, Scyther. They changed the music in here. This music in here goes to Balls of the Wall, in the older version. Shake, 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 shake the tree. I can guess what you're thinking. If you're psychic, you're not guessing, right? shouldn't be guessing at that point. You should know. That's my standing theory. I could be wrong. It's super effective! Kadabra. Let me guess, you own an Alakazam too, just to spite me. Ha, huh, you can't trade! Here's an insult for you. Oh, thank you, game. Appreciate that. Got to use Abra. Okay. It's not nearly as insulting. <laughs> I 
Haber ain't gonna make it. Obviously. Alright. We got him. And then we got the twins up above. Yeah, let's just beat you down while we're here. I think he's losing his pencils. He says he can prepare for any enemy, and then all he owns is a Tangela. Am I the only one that sees an issue with this? Also, I'm slightly uncertain why... Bird attacks are super effective against grass, but uh, I ain't complaining. Man, people just give your phone numbers like crazy. You don't want to hit them or anything. It's amazing. Still waiting for Gina to call me. She's the important one, because she finds items. There we go. To beat down the twins. There's quite a contrast between the contrast between the two they're using. We gotta take Marill out first. She is the threat. Never mind. She is no longer the threat. The only downside in these double battles is you can't uh can't see your XP go up. Oh, you lost. How sad. Daycare man. Let me guess. There's an egg. Alright. There we go. Let me go get our first Eevee egg. We're just running all sorts of back and forth right now. We oh. I'm not gonna lie. I would like to have Pokemon that when you hit them, uh, they cause statuses to, uh, they cause statuses to your enemies, but I don't like fighting Pokemon that have that ability. I find it frustrating. I don't know why you used Quick Claw. <laughs> you didn't need it, but okay. Cool to see it go off. How many Pokemon are in this grass that want to die right now? <laughs> there must be a lot, because they keep attacking me. Bye, Abra. Have a nice day. When I had a Poke Walker, I would always keep a uh, Eevee in it. So I could make him happy. Do you want it? Yes. Oh. Let's see, who's getting to go? I forgot Butterfree was here. Let me help you out, Butterfree. Alright, now we can get the egg.
Yay! Alright. Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> the ability to fly would be nice right now. I'm not gonna lie. You know, noticing every one of the transition screens, there's a Pokemon hiding on each one. That's what I'm noticing. <coughs> Let me verify. But now that we're here, we're a lot closer to the uh, Pokemon Center in case we get poisoned. So. Convenient. Alright, can be found on Route 37. And we are on Route 37. So, the convenience is real. Intimidate, really? Alright, you wanna play the game? I'll play that game. Oh, that... I wasn't kidding, that is cut pretty hard. Stantler's got some ridiculously high stats, though. For what it is. It's a freaking deer. Alright. Good XP at least. Can't argue with good XP. Well, you can, but you would be foolish to do so. I should say. <clears throat> and I know we don't need a Vulpix, but we needed to level up uh, Scyther anyway, so. And it gives an excuse to walk around enough to uh, get this egg to hatch, hopefully. And I get to beat down a bunch of Pidgeys. Who, who, who can argue with a bunch of Pidgeys being beat down? I did not know Pidgeotto could be found here. Huh. I learned something new. I feel special. And then I was looking up Nature's the other night, and it turns out that freaking Cinder here, this Nature doesn't do anything. Fury Cutter. Now we have a bug attack. Yay! <clears throat> you know, part of me thinks we can take the next gym already. But once again, we run into the problem. We don't have anything to uh, combat water, so... It's one of those ones where you're like, uh... Gotta go either way. Stomp is a really powerful attack. You know, I tend not to realize it until it starts happening to me. But that is a really 
Powerful attack. The plus side of Stantlers is they're worth a lot of XP. The downline, downside of Stantlers are they... They're a lot harder to kill. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Okay, I was wrong. That didn't hurt. As bad as it could've. Makes it more fun that way, right? You know, I don't know what's special about Fury Cutter, but I know there's something special about it. Or not. Maybe there isn't. Hmm. That did a lot of damage. Mental note. Wing attack is the way to go. Stab, I guess. Yeah, that's the other thing you need is, uh... You need a Stantler that knows... The... The stat that makes it so it identifies items. And then you need to know, uh... You need to make sure he knows, uh... It's either Thief or Snatch. In order to, uh... Get what you need. From, uh... To get a steel coat, anyway. I remember this because I really, really wanted a skizzer. And then it turns out I can't do anything about it. Yeah, that one right there. How he knows how to identify the item you have. That's the uh, type of Stantler you want if you want to uh, steal items from wild Pokemon. See? Frisk. Frisky. I think it's frisk, yeah. That's a good skill to have if you're trying to get you some items you're not sure about. Like miracle eggs or something. Miracle eggs? Yeah. Someone was talking about miracle eggs. And I'm sure there's others that have that same skill, but... <laughs> it's sad that Wing Attack is my most powerful attack. On the plus side, it has lots and lots of power points, so... Alright, I haven't seen a single Vulpix. I think I've been lied to. I think we're going to move back where the Nidorans are. Though Vulpix is pretty rare, so... But, you know, it's just grinding at this point, so... We
It says Route 37, 36, and 48. So it's a debate whether to have more XP and less likelihood of catching Vulpix, or a higher chance of doing it, but more likely to get bogged down in uh, waiting. All the wing attacks. In all the right places. Yay! And the downside is we just run the risk of being poisoned, so that definitely is going to put a... Uh, that might slow down the process, if you will, of what we're trying to do here. We gotta admit, it's a pretty elusive Pokemon. You know, we've seen it once in what? 20 minutes, I wanna say? So. That could be an issue. Alright. I'm going to need you not to roar. I'm okay with this. And that is why we have Scyther right there, folks. False Swipe is a great move. All right, we got our Vulpix. Give a nickname to Vulpix. Hmm. We'll just call her Foxy. All right. some Pokemon around. She can replace Onyx. Now I need to figure out where else I can get Thunderstones because that's going to be the next issue. There's a beauty contest in the next, the next town over, and I think that might have thunderstones too. It sucks because in the previous game you could just buy that shit, or in the predecessor.